it's uh, 417, 418, I call, uh, we convene from recess and ask you to join me in the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Amen. Thank you. <laughs> Good to see you. I'm surprised most more people don't come. They're what? what? They're watching. Yeah, I know. Hey, we'll do the budget review next. with the economic development budget. Last year they had 5,000. They're requesting 5,000 this year. I make a motion to approve that. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All these budgets, just so you know, were reviewed in a work session, so we went through them and discussed them. The election and registration budget last year was 19,120. This year, they're asking for $6,085. Reason for the decrease is it's only one election this year. Make a motion to approve the $6,085. Second. All in favor? Aye. The registration budget was $9,447. This year, they're requesting $4,300. The same reason it's one election. Make a motion to approve this. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 The treasurer's budget last year was eleven thousand and thirty dollars. This year if they're requesting eight thousand nine hundred and thirty dollars. Um, the reason for the decrease is we've changed, made a few changes in that. We have streamlined the, duties yeah, streamlined. greatly with our That's new right. finance director. So the workload for the treasurer is going to be exponentially less. So in turn, we reduce the compensation in accordance with that. So if anyone wants to be a treasurer out there, we need one, and it pays 6000 a year, just so you know. Make a motion. Who's the treasurer now? Harry. Harry. Yep. Harry. Yep. His term is up in March. So. Right. Oh, so he's not going to do it again? No. So if you're interested... So I make a motion to approve the $8,930 for the treasurer. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Um, I was going to hold off on Kelly's because she wanted to be here. Uh, highway Department. Last year, their budget was $1,349,000. This year they're requesting one million three hundred ninety-five thousand three hundred ninety-five and eight eighty-one. Make a motion to approve this. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Transfer station last year was five hundred and thirteen thousand dollars. This year they're asking. Five hundred, five hundred forty thousand six hundred and forty-four dollars. The reasoning for this was we hired a part-time person for twenty-two hours a week, um, and we did increase the uh, uniform, glove, and shoe allowance from twenty-four hundred dollars to three thousand. We'll make a motion to approve this. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Recreation Department. Last year, the budget was $163,100. This year, they're asking $148,895. Um, the reason 
reasoning for that was we didn't have a recreation director for Mount Monitor. So in the 20, 21, yeah, I think uh, May 1st. Yeah, we this... not, no longer had a rec director. We we're, we're, yeah, we're budgeting next year part-time from January to May 1st. And then full time. And then full time. We're anticipating with COVID to be gone, be full time from May 1st forward. So I make a motion to approve $148,895. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. meeting for Monday, September 28th. I make a motion to approve this. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Town of Osby check voucher totals. This request was from April, well, August 31st. That was a separate payment made for the benefit package in the amount of $112,000. Four hundred eighty-three dollars and forty-three cents. Make a motion to approve that. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Town of Osby check voucher totals for week ending September twenty-six, pay date of September twenty-eight. <coughs> Total payroll was forty-one thousand three hundred thirty-eight dollars and sixty-six cents. Total accounts payable was $26,204.90. Make a motion to approve that. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. This is from the state of New Hampshire. To the inhabitants, inhabitants of the town of Osby in the county of Carroll, New Hampshire, you are hereby notified to meet at the Osby Town Hall at 55 Main Street in Center Osby on Tuesday, the third day of November, 2020. The polls will be open between the hours of 8 a.m. and 7 p.m. To bring in your votes for the president, president and vice president of the United States, the governor, the United States senator, the United States representative, executive council, state senator, state rep representative, and county officers. I make a motion to approve this. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 I have a warrant from the water and sewer for $161.39. I make a motion we approve this warrant. I'll uh, second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion carries. Aye. I have a warrant from the water and sewer for $96,108.12. I make a motion we approve this warrant, water and sewer. I will second that. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Motion carries. <clears throat> I have a certification of yield taxes assessed uh, for Jeanette Fernal, map 111, lot 2, in the amount of 361000 Excuse me, three hundred sixty-one dollars and twenty-eight cents. The yield tax warrant. I make a motion. We approve this warrant. I second that. All those in favor? Aye. 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 I have a yield tax levy warrant in the amount of eighty-six dollars and thirty-nine cents for Joe Duchesne. Map 111, Lot 1. I make a motion we approve this warrant. 
I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Motion carries. Is that it? Yeah. I have a notice of decision from the planning board for tax map 263, lot 15. They were granted a subdivision, um, or six lot of subdivision on 112 acres. And I guess that's it for that information. I have a notice of decision from the Zoning Board of Adjustment. It was for 45 Old Granite Road, map 133, lot 7. They were granted a special exception from Article 34.3E, Institutional Uses Group Home. Um, this is for Whitehorse to remodel an existing building vacant for more than two years in the village <coughs> district to have a business in the middle portion of the building which supervise residential care for people in recovery for addiction in the two flanking original wood homes. I have a notice, this is from the planning board from the town of Lincoln. They are holding a public hearing to erect a 120 foot high telecommunication cell tower. Uh, I guess they notify us because we are considered a butter because it's high up, we could possibly see it, which I don't really think would be possible, but I guess they have to follow the protocol. So if anybody here wants to see it, you can. Uh, that's it for me on the paperwork. One thing I want to just note, as of now, outstanding unpaid taxes are $1,126,000 as of today. That's all I got. Kelly's budget so last year her budget was three hundred and thirty thousand four hundred and twenty five dollars. This year she's requesting three hundred twenty three thousand five hundred dollars. Uh, the basic uh, reduction for her is her deputy is only working part time. She retired, she's only working part time. Make a motion to approve that. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Another little comment. There will be no Slackman's meeting next week due to the holiday on the And Matt, do you have anything you'd like to do? Yep, a couple of thank you. A couple of quick updates. Um, there's a school board meeting tonight. Uh, you can continue to easily link to that information from the town's webpage right on the main page. There's a link for school board agendas. Uh, and want to continue to encourage people to go and voice their input so we're represented there. Uh, Route 16 will be closed uh, for the installation of the new bridge um, starting on 10-16. Uh, the bridge, the detour will essentially be Newman Drew Road, uh, but the state has given us warning that will be, Route 16 will be fully impassable for at least three days starting then. And in a bit of good news, I did receive confirmation uh, from the governor's office that the second round of CARES Act grant funding I requested has been fully approved. So we'll be receiving a check for over $8,600 to reimburse us for some expenses. Uh, and I thought that was exciting news. So. Yes. Any old business? Nope. Okay. Any new business? Yeah, we'll open the meeting back up for public input. I'm not looking for any trouble today. <laughs> <laughs> There's never trouble. Okay, meeting, no public input. I'll make a motion to adjourn. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. I was right, you did break the record. Not bad, huh?